What's up, Scrollgers? It's Nerf here, and today we're uh, taking a break from the test server shenanigans on the live server playing a ranked match. Uh, if this guy accepts the match, if he does, it's skinny thick. Good luck, fun have. Good luck, have fun. So, a little odd deck I'm playing right now, a Gravelock deck. Um, I don't I'm, don't feel bad for just like kind of mi mixing it up in ranked right now because ranked does not matter too much right now because uh, likely, I'm not sure if this has been officially stated, but uh, I think with the release of Echoes there's going to be a um, reset of ranked. So all of the ratings will go away like like Mojang did with uh, whatever it's called um, with, the, with the waypoints release and the release of the game so I don't really care too much about my rating right now I can go down or up I don't really care but I'm getting some practicing practicing in and also getting some gold which we'll need a lot of gold for, uh, you know do I dare play Desperation on this just so I can kill it next turn? That is crazy. I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to still stay this turn. That's why I was kind of afraid to play this Gravelock uh, Raider turn 1. Gravelock Raider probably the worst Gravelock. Um, it just needs like combo things to make it work. And also, without Gravelock Elder giving the attack anymore for Gravelock Raider, just uh, isn't good enough. Oh, he's going to remove away. And I'll, I kind of want to keep this normal element. I'm going to get rid of the desperation and play a great black outcast up top. Next turn, I'll play a Lockling Brood. I might just go ahead and. He's going to take middle of the board here, I see. Right, now he gets a source. Guess it doesn't really matter if it's one turn too late. Okay. Now I'm going to sacrifice the snarl because I want to keep that thunder surge. And I could move right in the middle here and hope he doesn't have a languid. That would be a really, really crazy play. No, I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna stay up top. A language would, a language would still hurt, but whatever. So next turn, I'll play another Lachlan Brood, most likely, and then follow. He did. He does have a language. So it's still great, great for him. It's, uh, I, sh uh, I didn't really want to play Lachlan Brood because Decay counters it so easily with language, but I didn't have another play. Okay. Uh, looks like I'm gonna be playing another Lachlan Brood. Didn't get a burn that I wanted. And hopefully he has, doesn't have like a brain lice or a languid. Come on, skinny thick. I did sacrifice a final dispersal. Maybe I should have kept that instead of the, the Thunder Surge. I don't know. I just felt like Thunder Surge might be better. Oblivion Seeker. And yay, he moves away. Now I wish I had the other thing. Uh, desperation. Hmm. Kill that. I'll just uh, sacrifice it for scrolls. I will I'll just move up kind of out of arm's way which does not really put me in a good position Would have been a lot nicer if I kept that VD instead of the Thunder Surge last turn. Okay, 
looks like I'm still gonna Thunder Surge though, maybe this turn. And he's not gonna take out Middle Idol right now. I will go ahead and T Surge. And I will move down with both. He draws some scrolls. I want a burn or violence for so I need to get rid of one of those threats. Surprise uh, this locking brute has made it this long. Maybe he has an answer to it, but he's just not like threatened by it that much right now, so he's just rather play creatures, I don't know. Come on, burn. Get me a burn. Those are scrolls. At least I'm at a higher resource count than him right now. That's always good. He moves down and away, so he's kind of running away. Which is good, means I don't really need a burn. Oh, I get rid of the potion of resistance. And another lock lane brood. Uh. Hmm. That's okay. I'll play it. I'm gonna do a lot of idle damage, I guess. And what's it gonna hit? It's the front guy, so he dies to it. A thunder surge. And if he doesn't have matches to those, I'll have some idols taken down. Lockling broods for the win. Risk reward scroll done right. Usually they don't get too much uh, value. But still, f four four attacking every turn. It's quite strong if your opponent can't deal with it. Goes to six. What do we see? Maybe Witch Doctor, maybe a Halls of Omlasa. He does move up. Witch Doctor. Okay. So. Uh, I want another Thunder Surge. It's my lucky day, isn't it? Thunder Surge, uh. What does that do? Right now I'm able to kill this anyways. Thunder Surge, but does that let me kill that too? That brings you down to two. And then you kill it. And then you kill its thing. And oh no, Thunder Surge doesn't really do anything else. I'm still able to kill. No, I'm not able to kill. Damn it. <laughs> this is getting confusing now. But Gravelock Elder's good. I'm still gonna come down and destroy his stuff. Yeah, I'm still gonna come down and destroy stuff. And I'm hesitant leaving this middle idol open. Whatever. Okay, now that is a pretty huge body here. Yeah, he doesn't. Lachlan Roots can get pretty annoying, just like Kenville Greaves can get annoying. And uh, really, any one to count on creatures if you can't answer them. Man, you're kind of dumb. So, Valentus Dispersal, come to me. Maybe he's talking about what's annoying is that this Greyflock Elder comes down to bring these guys health to 5, which is one too high for the lifesteal to kill. If he's a damning curse on Greyflock Elder, then it's pretty good for him. Looks like he's fishing for scrolls though, because he sacrificed for scrolls when he has so many scrolls in his hand already. So it's good that uh, he won't be able to make any big, bigger plays soon because he's only at six resources. Mudo Fighter and maybe a Brain Lice finally take one of these guys out. So Mudo Fighter is um, pretty good because it's not going to take any damage from that Thunder Surge. 
and a rock. Okay, I think I still should Thunder Surge. Because... I need to take out that Witch Doctor, and I'm not gonna, like, double Iron Whip. I could have just gone for these idols before. I don't know. Okay. Let's, uh... Sacrifice the Snorkel Omelette for scrolls. Another Elder. I think it's just a Thunder Surge. We have to get rid of that guy. Another Thunder Surge. And... I mean... Do I dare go for like the 1 in 4 chance I can kill this big Rod Eater and move both these guys down and have this guy attack the auto first? I should just take my uh... Take my 2 kills here. Yeah, that's what I'll do. And I'll move like that. Okay. But now he has a 10-6 Rod Eater. And it did hit him. So... I guess uh, maybe it would have worked out if I moved to the bottom there to take out the Rod Eater. Does look like I'm in a good position to match though. Maybe I'll take down a couple idols this coming turn. Really, these Lockling Broods, huge uh, risk reward play. Has paid off this match so far for me. It really has. What is he going to do, like, damning her or something? Or oh, putting 10 attack to kill one? Man, he's really, uh, it really sucks for him. He has only drawn one language over. I mean, he, I don't know, maybe he sacrificed a language or two in his starting hand. But, uh, Brain likes his language. Both ways that Decay can deal with these guys. And that's the third Rot Eater on the border right now. I will look to get my... Oh, there's a Harvester. Okay. Can I go to 7 this coming turn? Can I do something with an Iron Whip? Uh... So, if I... What's it? I need... If I Iron Whip you... And you go to seven. That I can kill you. Problem is you're there. Uh, also, do it. I want to take out this huge guy. I'll get rid of you. Or actually. I'd rather just take out two, so I'll play the Elder. So I'll kill that. Then I'll do that. Move down in the gray block burrows. Rod Eater has 12 attack. And now my uh, blocking brood is on the bottom here so he can run away. But finally, he takes them both down. They uh, certainly um, did their job though. Now, he's he. He doesn't have enough resources to be able to activate this harvester. Can't afford a damage curse, and there's nothing to soul steal on the board. So, a lot of ways I can destroy this harvester in my turn. Um, there's the other brain lace. This is will take a long time to die though, this elder, because it's not cursed. And let's see if I can get a burn or something. Uh, ooh, Iron Whip Copperado is gonna take out a rot the rot eater. Okay, I cannot kill this harvester, but I will be able to uh, do that. So, what's he gonna kill? You're gonna die of brainless anyway, so 
What if you do the bottom? And I'm not gonna empty my head entirely. Okay, middle level destroyed. And we'll see what he kills. I was probably, probably gonna destroy this middle elder. Maybe not the best placement by me. But if he draws middle idol, then these guys both have four are gonna have five attack. Um, and then his idols are looking pretty uh, crumbly. So Gravelock Raider. Probably for scrolls next turn. Now there's something for him to soul steal. And he still only had six resources. At round 13, as a decay player, I think he'd want to be higher. There's a harvester. And I think Grave Like Bros is kind of an underrated scroll. It's like lingering, so it just like stays there and gives you uh, gives you more attack. Your four is pretty good. All right, he's gonna go to finally go up to more resources and see what he plays. Maybe a curse monger. Maybe or he's gonna play two drop and maybe another another two drop. No, so maybe he just wants to go up to more resources, but he didn't really have the scrolls to do so. Uh, burn. I guess I'll burn you. And now I got a miles worth. So I'll hold on to that. If I had a another animal or a fury, that's our nice sacrifice for scrolls. Or no, I wouldn't have. I wouldn't have found this copper out because I needed to get the burn to draw the extra scroll for that. So I'll kill you. Deal 5 damage, put pressure on you. I'm actually just going to put a ton of pressure here. And I'm close to winning. Mount Dispersal next turn. I decided not to play that highest one. I want to be able to sacrifice something else besides that Mount Dispersal. And whatever I top deck. And with this uh, Elder uh, Poisoned. It will be taking damage, which means the burrows are going to be procced again, so these get, these grave locks will have some extra attack. There is a witch doctor, and I guess maybe a trizen in front, or a darkling in front of that. Trizen. Okay, so I can't quite win. Let's see if I just, I just need like a fury to win. Uh, let's get rid of smuggler. Desperation does not win because I need to be able to get an attack in, so I'll just clear his board. So, violent dispersal. And. Then you die. And I put more pressure on the board. And next turn, I don't think he's gonna be able to defend. To defend uh, his idols. So. If he does, he's just going to give up creatures and I'll just win the next turn following and stuff like that. He up to 8. He, wow, how did he jump to 8? He was at 6 like so long. I was like, he leapfrogged me in resources. But it's safe to say that I uh, control the board. Gravelocks, really what Gravelocks hinge on is control of the board. They are just... Uh, you win basically if you get those consecutive four drop, five drop, six drop grave locks, like on turns four, five, six, and your opponent doesn't really have great stuff early on. And you lose if you don't have that stuff. Because they're not that great at coming back in the game. I mean, you saw, like, I got pretty lucky with uh, Thunder Surges this game. I threw them at the right time, and was right in there. So grave locks, they were a big powerhouse in the ladder, and I I've used them when they're really good with the grave lock uh, before it got nerfed. Grave lock elder, a lot of old rank match videos on this channel are of that, and you see they're still kind of viable, but definitely not at their old power level. So uh, 
GD GG to Skinny Thick. That was a pretty fun match to rate that five stars. And I guess that'll be it for today. So like the video if you enjoyed. Subscribe for more content like this. Follow me on Twitter. Follow me on Twitch. And I will see you all next time. Keep on scrolling, scrollsers.